this video, I will be talking exactly about the current Bitcoin breakdown we're experiencing on the market and I will be exactly talking about my price targets, the levels to be watching, but more importantly, I will be discussing the Bitcoin daily chart where we're currently seeing an insane, insane rising wedge getting formed. And is this going to be resulting in Bitcoin having a more significant pullback? I will be exactly talking about this on today's update video. And of course, I will be discussing many other important, interesting things we're also spotting here. So make sure to watch this video till the end because this is definitely the video that you want to be watching. So can we once again slap it up to 600 likes? Yesterday we did it, so I believe we can do it once again today. Slap up that like button and let's jump straight away in towards the content. And let me kick off this video with looking at the imminent short term and like i warned you guys yesterday on while bitcoin was touching the twenty-five thousand dollars, bitcoin is trading in a rising wedge and a rising wedge is a more kind of a typical bearish bias pattern and like you can see after that point right there on the time of recording from yesterday's video we clearly did broke down of the rising wedge earlier this morning we pumped back towards the upside and we got straight away rejected by this trend line and currently we are coming down again so right now we can clearly see that bitcoin is seeing a significant rejection from the rising wedge here and if you don't know already the price target of this rising wedge is all the way down towards this green box of support what is laying somewhere around the 22.8k so do be very much aware that bitcoin can be seeing an even more significant drop from here on and that's going to be from the current point of recording an approximately five percent correction towards the downside i do think it is possible to reach the lower side once again here after seeing such kind of a losing um, formation on the market getting formed right furthermore looking really at bitcoin i personally also think that if we're going to zoom out towards that uh, larger time frame larger time frame rising wedge we can see also in the four hour still in order for me and in order to be bullish on bitcoin i personally think we need to be breaking above this trend right here and if we break above this trend line right here I am going to be one of the mega bulls on the market right now. However, as long as we're not going to do so, I will remain very calm. And for me to really open a shorting position, I need to see this green line of support getting broken. So I am not in a trade right now here, but if we do break below either this green line of support, I'm going to be opening a new Bitcoin short. If we are going to be breaking above the red line of resistance, I am going to be opening a new long right here. So that is going to be my strategy. I am waiting on the sidelines before until I see a clear enough of a signal what will allow me to, of course, open a very strong trade on the market right now. Furthermore, we can clearly still see the daily time frame did broke above that 23.8k. So I am expecting that the 23.8k, what was of course historical resistance right now, after we're going to retest it, it is probably going to be providing somewhat of a significant amount of support. So I wouldn't be all too surprised as well if we're going to retest the 23.8k to see a strong lingo, a little bounce on the Bitcoin price action right here. And that could be also a very good trading opportunity. And talking about trading, if you want to be trading, make sure to check out BitGet in the link in the description. It is the best exchange to trade. No VPN, no KYC, and you can trade it from wherever you want also from the us so make sure to check it out in the link in the description and you can also claim an insane deposit bonus if you do use that link furthermore looking at bitcoin on the daily time frame we can currently see that also bitcoin has been forming and rising wedge on the four hourly time frame what is an extremely bearish bias pattern it is also forming one on the daily time frame and i am definitely very worried about the bitcoin price action right now i want to be extremely bullish however still i do see these bearish bias patterns getting formed on the market what is not necessarily having an all too great of an effect on how i do feel in the market right now yes for sure we could still break bullish of such kind of a rising wedge but still the more likely scenario is that it is in this case going to be breaking down and the price target of the daily rising wedge on the bitcoin chart is also all the way down here towards levels around nineteen thousand dollars do i think we necessarily have to reach it no but am i definitely prepared for bitcoin to go down 
for sure i am always going to be prepared for potential lower targets on the market so yes for me to be bearish on bitcoin for me to see of course okay right now we are going to confirm the breakdown we need to see of course a break below this green bar, uh, green line of support and also a thing that you should take into account right now here is that right now approximately 137,000 bitcoin is estimated to be released from mount gox at the end of august so don't forget this there will be an approximately 137,000 bitcoins going to get released in towards the market after the hack early in 2014 from mount gox so be very much aware that there's still going to be a significant amount of sell pressure that could be entering the market what potentially could drag bitcoin down at the end of august so still i am going to also take it with uh, a lot of caution right now in the market i am not going to be all too big of a bear right now i am still buying more bitcoin every single day that is what you need to understand because many people do think once i say bitcoin is looking bearish on the four hour um that they're going to tell me okay so you're selling off your all your bitcoin no i am not because that is not a thing i'm currently trying to risk i am still buying more bitcoin every single day i am just stacking more bitcoin and of course how i am also stacking more bitcoin is by trading bitcoin once it breaks down once i see the market is probably going to move down further i am opening a shorting position so i can benefit from the market going down so once the market does go down i will make even more money because i anticipated it so you have to understand if i am bearish on bitcoin it doesn't mean that i'm selling off my bitcoin no i'm only looking for a new trading opportunity on the price section so that is also currently what i'm doing i am potentially opening a shorting position if we do break bearish and uh yeah still in the end of the day i'm still buying more bitcoin every single day because my strategy remains to be the same buy more bitcoin every single day and just dollar cost average furthermore still if i'm zooming out towards even larger time frames i don't think that bitcoin is looking all too bearish because if we're looking right now at the three day time frame on bitcoin and this is of course something different we can see that the three day rsi downtrend officially got broken and you can clearly see right now on this chart we have been trading in this rsi downtrend for bitcoin for over for 578 days here and this has been a significant downtrend on the bitcoin rsi and it has been finally getting broken so am i significantly bearish on bitcoin right now on the larger time frame so the three day time frame or even bigger no i am not i am actually looking quite bullish on these time frames right now only on the imminent short term we could be expecting some minor pullbacks because yes in the end of the day we want to be having a straight face and look at this uh, chart and we can clearly still see okay we're forming lower highs every single time on this market and for me to confirm that bitcoin is officially entering bullish stages we either need to break above the thirty-two thousand dollars to confirm a higher high or we look at this different chart that i prepared for you guys out there and this is the three day super trend and the three day super trend has got an historical record for predicting bullish markets and bearish markets per Lee. as you can see right now here we are currently still in the sell stage we're still in the bearish stage like you can see but as soon as bitcoin does break above the 27.6k we are entering the bullish stage again and always historically speaking if we are entering the bullish stage we tend to see significant price rises last time around that it this happened we saw an 85 percent rise the time before that it happened we saw an approximately 800 percent rise and also the other way around once we broke below the super trend we saw 40 percent correct direction here we broke below it and we saw an over 66 percent correction so yes bitcoin could be in for of course a very very bullish period in the market if we do break above the twenty-seven thousand dollars, but as long as we're not doing so we are not officially breaking bullish on the larger time frames and of course if you are right now subscribed to the channel you will be getting alerted you will be getting notified as soon as we do break above this level and as soon as we do get a buy signal you will be the first one to get notified on this channel so guys Thank you so much for watching towards this amazing new update video here on the channel. Slap up that like button and of course consider subscribing as well. If you want to learn how to copy trade or if you want to learn how to trade in general, check out the videos that are currently popping up above and we'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out, goodbye, till the next one.